the Texas, Texas Tech is lined up to kick the ball off first, and we are ready to go. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Makes it to the 37. That's not everyday speed you're talking about with this guy. This is a unique burst combined with a really impressive field vision. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. Number two, the ball carrier. Gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Seven for Mike, Mike seven. Blue for Nice run there. Good run by the quarterback. The thing that impresses me is the decision making. He sees an opening, decides to turn it upfield, and gets a nice gain and a first down. From the 48 yard line, first down. Oklahoma! Gets out to around the 38. That, that makes it first, first and ten. ten. Oh, switch, my switch, my switch. Mike seven. Mike seven. Down. Blue fourteen. Blue. Two yard carry by the fullback. The sophomore just stuck it to the ball carrier right there. That's a very good tackle. From the thirty six yard line. Second down. Makes it out to about the 20. Anytime this guy carries the ball and gets a little space, we could be talking about six. The 10-yard line. Well, that's another first down, Brad. That's the fifth first down on this drive. You know, they're, they're, this offense isn't hitting a lot of big plays, but they're very, very consistent with their execution. It's putting a lot of pressure right now on this defense. And they make the stop at the one-yard line. That's good for a of 10 yards. That brings us. We're at play number nine of this current drive. A short yardage defense here. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. That was just smash mouth, helmet to chin football by the defensive line there. They dominated the point of attack. So here we go. It's third and goal from the two yard line. He laterals the ball. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. And he converts the extra point. A 10-play, 74-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running backs. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Texas Tech's coaches admitted to us that they game plan around this guy. It's kind of different for a wide receiver. It's usually a running back or a quarterback, but he's paid off for him so far. He really has, and I, I found it very refreshing as we travel around the country and, and visit with so many of these players to find a high-profile wide receiver who's a selfless guy. He's a great leader from everything that they've told us. He's a guy that wants to go out there and make sure that the team gets the win first before he gets his catches. Kind of a rare breed in today's game of college football, but he's an exceptional player. First guy on the field and the last guy off the track. Tackle after a decent pickup. That's a game of seven. That'll bring up second and two. Go! 
Fires it out. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. Gets out to around the 32. Gains his way to the 20 yard line. From the 20 yard line, first down. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Loss of three on the play. That brings up second and 13. Here's the eighth play of the series. Caught with room to work. They'll bring him down around the nine yard line. He's going to try and scramble. And he's tackled at the seven. Touchdown, Red Raiders. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A nice 10 play, 76 yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So their last drive resulted in six points. Do you think we'll see the same result on this one? They ran the ball extremely well on their last drive. And until this defense figures out how to stop it, I think they'll have no problem moving the ball down the field. That's a team that made on the play. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Seven's a mic. Mike seven. It's just me and you. It's just me and you. Hey. Nice run to the outside. Nice run there by the tailback, and it's good for the first. Solid five-yard pickup. He was almost able to get to the secondary, but as it is, he still manages to move the sticks. We played one quarter. We get a tie game at 7-7. Set to resume action here in the second quarter, and we've got a tight ball game. Pitches in, and he's got a lane. And down he goes, around the 47-yard line. The option's one of the more difficult plays to defend. The defense went after the quarterback, which left the running back with plenty of room. First and 10, ball on the 47. He's got an opening. Brought down at the 36. They've obviously found a formula for moving the ball against this defense. Let's see if any adjustments are made before their backs are really against the wall. Set down. Hey. 
He's taken down at about the 23-yard line. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. First and 10, ball on the 23. Runs outside for a nice game. Good for a game, six yards. That'll make it second and four. Larry, Larry, Larry. Mike seven. Mike seven. Here we go. Set. He's on the run. Knocked out of bounds around the two yard line. Gaining 15 yards. That makes it first and goal. And this is the eighth play of the drive. They put everyone up on the line. Blue 14! Blue 14! Touchdown, Tech! And he hits the PAT. A nice eight play, 76 yard drive. And the result, seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. They can really demoralize the defense when they drive the ball down the field. And a lot of the yards came on the ground. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I think any good football team has to have an ability to answer. And that's exactly what we just saw. One team scores a touchdown, the other team comes right back and puts another touchdown on the board. This is getting exciting. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. No game. That makes it second and ten. Quick pass, intercepted. Has some daylight. The 10. Touchdown, Yellow Jackets. He makes the PAT. Georgia Tech is ready to kick it away. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Red Raiders struggling trying to get their star wide receiver in this game. And sometimes, you know, Herbie, it's almost like uh, a jump shooter in basketball. Get him to the free throw line, get him one free one from 15 feet and see how he can do. They got to get the ball in his hand somehow. I agree with you 100%. I mean, it's just a matter of just one play, one touch to get this guy going because he has that kind of ability. And up to this point, they've not been able to find a way to get him the ball. Give credit. A lot of credit to this defense for coming in with a good plan, but now it's up to the offense to make their own adjustments to kind of counter that attack by this defense to be able to get the, the ball into the hands of their go-to guy. That is a loss of one yard. That'll bring up second and 11. So an empty backfield with five wide receivers. Caught out in the open. Tackle at the 45-yard line. They complete the slant. Good for 10. And they've got the dime package in there to try and deal with this five-receiver look. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. Around the 38-yard line. Gets it out quickly. Offense lines up in a five-wide set in a defense, anticipating pass here. Tackle made at the 29. From the 29-yard line, it's first down. Throws this one away. 
And this play is number eight on the drive. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. From the 16 yard line. First down. Nice run up the middle. Gain of six on the draw play. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Texas Tech's going to use their first time out of the half here. And he's taken down at the 12-yard line. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. I think he just barely got it. That's a great job by both the quarterback and receiver to keep this drive alive. And this is the 12th play of the drive. And he makes it out to about the five-yard line. No game in the play. That brings him second and goal. And they make the stop right around the two-yard line. The back gets three on the carry. We've watched this guy play, and over the course of his college career, he's made some spectacular tackles. Nice play. Touchdown, Texas Tech. That gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. This guy has great vision out of the backfield. Even if a hole isn't there, he's patient enough to wait for one to open, and then he hits it. And he tacks on the extra point. Texas, Texas Tech is lining up to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And they can forget about returning this one. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Georgia Tech is up by a touchdown. Throws complete. He's got space to work. The Yellow Jackets will use their first time out of the half. It's first and ten. Ball on the 37. Set. Oklahoma. Check, check. H. Bruin. H. Bruin. Under heavy pressure. Caught, and he's hit immediately. Georgia Tech's going to have to use their second time out of the half. He's on the run. Runs with it, and he's got room. They'll bring him down at the 45. That makes it first and 10. Set, Oklahoma, okay. He gets sacked on the play. He scrambles. And he is drilled at the 41. Scrambling around. And he's tackled at the 41-yard line. So he tried to scramble there, but it didn't even look like he got a yard. He just got lucky to get to the line of scrimmage after that play. They'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt. Georgia Tech is hoping to make this a two-score game. Kicks up, and he splits the uprights. We've played a half of football. Georgia Tech's got a 10-point lead. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. There's no question you'd rather be up by two scores as opposed to being down by two scores. I mean, David, I totally, that was an easy answer. Look, yes. I, I totally <laughs> get that. 
But I think there is a mindset there that when you have that two-score lead, you're trying to protect something. You don't want to give it up. And if you allow the other team to get close, then, then things can get tied on you. Can a two-score edge sometimes be a little bit dangerous just in terms of mindset? I think mindset and also with coaches. A lot of times you see coaches, they get less aggressive. You know, especially on the defensive side of the football, when you get up two scores and you had so much success blitzing the first half and applying pressure, now you're not as comfortable leaving out guys on an island playing man-to-man -man and giving up big plays. Yeah. So I think you got to make sure that you continue to do what you are doing. Don't make those big mistakes, but also don't stray away from the game plan. Right now, what, it, what you've implemented has worked. Continue to do it. Just about set to start the second half. What are you looking for? I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. Excellent kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Cut, set, ten, cut. Ah. He goes out of bounds right around the 28-yard line. That's good go, 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 go. That'll make it second and seven. Check, 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 check. From their own 22 yard line, third down. Alert, alert, alert! Cat, cat. That's going to bring up fourth down. The defense held their ground on that play. The quarterback just wasn't able to find any open receivers. That'll bring up fourth and 13. They've got 10 guys up. It looks like they're going to try to block this one. He really got a hold of that one. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. They'll take over here, ready to start a new series. Roger, Roger. Seven to Mike. Mike seven. I got one. I got one. <laughs> And no one can get it. It bounces out of bounds. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 45. Mike, seven. Gal. 10, 19. And he's leveled at the 32-yard line. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. First down. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Seven to Hut. seven. Oklahoma. Hut. Hut. He's at the 20. Makes it out to about the 10. That's good for a First down. From the 10 yard line. First down. They'll drop him for a loss. That makes it second and right. Tight end right. Tight end right. Four down, four down. Seven to Mike. Down. Oklahoma. They bring him down in the backfield. You know, it looked to me like he should have made the pitch, but he kept it instead and wound up going backwards. Third down and a couple of miles here. Ball on the 17-yard line. And he throws right away. Picked off by the senior. 
Brad, not only a huge interception to get the football back, maybe have a chance to get back into this game, but this could really change momentum. You can see the players and how they're responding down there on the sideline about how excited they are to get the football back and have a chance to put points on the board. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. This safety is as vicious a player as you're going to find. He will make the tackle every single time. He has some room. The action keeper gets him two, maybe three yards. That'll bring up third and four. Makes the catch and look out. Steps out of bounds around the 33 yard line. Looks to him again, complete. And he tackles him hard at the 43 yard line. Third down again. That'll bring up third and inches. They come out in a five wide set. Quick strike to the receiver, and down he goes, right around the 46-yard line. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Brought down around the 41-yard line. Number 32 wins his end. Five wide. He's taken down at the 31 yard line. And he throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. It's the 11th play of the drive. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. He's tackled immediately after the catch. Five-yard loss on the play. Well, that's just a sound play by the defense. They dropped him well short of the line of scrimmage. They'll call on the field goal unit. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. The kick is away. It's long enough. And it's good. They're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. We'll have to see now how the offense responds this time after throwing a pick on their last drive. One general rule in any game is to hold on to the ball. If you're in the negative in the turnover department, your chances of winning decrease exponentially. Nice run to the left there. That'll make it second and They're about four yards away here on second down. Georgia Tech is up seven. Set 10 19. He gets it out to about the 47 yard line. Gain of 16 on the play. First down. Hey. 
from their own 47-yard line. It's first down. He's out of bounds at the 43. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. That makes it third and three. A great game so far, and it looks like it'll be decided in the fourth. 24-17, Yellow Jackets. in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. Strong play by the defense, but they'll come up just shy of the stop. From the 41-yard line, first down. He's scrambling. Seven-yard pickup on the scramble by the quarterback. Let's go, D. Mike seven, Mike seven. Georgia Tech is up a score. Gets it out quickly. He's tackled at the 23. Here's the eighth play of the series. First down. Larry, Larry. Seven to Mike. Mike seven. Set. Hot. Oklahoma. Gains his way to the 13-yard line. That brings up second and one. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. Could they get another interception here? That's what they got last time this offense was in the red zone. Oklahoma! Hut. 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 Tackle made at about the five-yard line. Gaining eight yards. Tenth play of the drive. Touchdown, Tech! He made a great move to get into the end zone. There's a perfect play call. They look like they practiced that one a few times. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. They'll come back out with some confidence from having put through the field goal last time. Set. Complete. He's got room. Tackle at about the 43-yard line. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. He's going to try and scramble. Now he shows his running ability. And he's taken down at the 38. Now he tries to buy some time. No one opens, so he's going to run. Scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. And they make the stop right around the 10 yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. 
gets it out to his receiver, and he can't hang on. That wasn't necessarily a big hit. It was a smart play, avoiding the penalty, but making sure to get there in time to break up the score. It's second and goal. Ten yards to the end zone. Quick throw out to the receiver. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly to find his man for good yardage. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. And they got him for a loss. A yard if they're lucky on that pass play. The defense respects this guy and knows they have to pay a lot of attention to him. He didn't have any room after that catch. So from a yard out, the offense is going to try to stay on the field here on fourth down and goal. And that was a big stop defensively. Yeah, they only needed a few yards here to keep the drive alive. Great job by the defense to shut them down. You really can't say enough about this defense. Fourth and short, and they really showed up on that play. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. He gets out to about the 17-yard line. That one got him out of some danger. The offense caught a break there. Great run by this guy to get him out of the face of their own end zone. Makes it out to about the 26. A strong run by the fullback will give him a gain of nine. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Pitches it. He's got the corner. He's to the 40. He's at midfield. He goes down at the 28-yard line. Wow, that was some run. It's worth the price of admission just to see this guy get into the open field. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a game of seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. That's a great tackle at the 18. That's good for a gain of three yards. First down. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. And he's getting the ball here. And he's getting the ball. Set. Ten, nine, eight. They'll bring him down at the 16. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on the 16-yard line. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Favorite play in football of your quarterback. Take a knee. The Red Raiders, I'm sure, are secure in the knowledge that despite this setback today, they still have one of the best players in the country. Well, this is a devastating loss, but it's one that they're going to have to put behind them. And, and as you said, they still have one of the best players in the country. They don't need to deviate their plan, get back to really what they know, and that's getting the ball to their star player. And next week, I'm sure they'll be fine. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Street, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.